Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are going to talk about something a bit different than what we usually talk about on this channel, but that is how to transfer your presets from desktop, like from Lightroom CC, the desktop version to your mobile version. I actually love photography and I do this in my spare time as a passion and I have a lot of presets that I would love to use on my mobile phone but after looking on YouTube and spending tons of hours looking for tutorials that will help me out I couldn't find anything that would explain how to transfer those presets yes there were some tutorials but they were complicated and I found a way that it's super easy to transfer your presets that you currently have on your Lightroom CC the desktop version to your mobile Mobile. So let's jump into Lightroom and let me show you how easy it is to transfer your current presets that you have on your Lightroom mobile. So first, before starting anything, just to keep everything organized, let's create a collection. To create a collection, you just click on that plus next to the collection, create collection. And here, let's type, uh, for example, I want to transfer my Peter McKinnon presets to the mobile. So we will just say PM mobile presets. Cool. So you create this. The next step is not mandatory, but just because I want to keep everything organized, I created some thumbnails where I wrote the title of the preset. And let me show you why. Let me just remove this image and let's import those thumbnails that I was talking about into our collection. So what we need to do is click here on import. Look for our files, which are on our desktop. and import these thumbnails. But before we actually import them, make sure that on the right side where you have the file handling, you select add to collection and you select your collection that we previously created. So after you do this, just import the files and they should show up in your created collection. We're halfway through. What we need now is to apply those presets to our images. So the way we're gonna do that, we're gonna switch to the develop tab, click here, and then afterwards, from our preset panel, we're gonna apply the specific preset to the thumbnail that we created. So for example, in my case, this is Ansel. So I will look for my Ansel preset and just apply it. And you do this for all your images, for example, avatar and so on. So all the presets that you have, you have to apply the preset to that particular image. So what do you do after applying your presets to your thumbnails or images? Well, the only thing you have to do now is to export those images as DNG files. And the way you do that, you select the image, you go to file or you right click on the image and then you select export with preset and you select DNG. Once you do this, you can save this to any folder you would like, but the only thing you have to keep in mind is that you have to have access to that folder on your mobile device as well. So what I did is I used the iCloud to create a folder and I saved it on files, Lightroom presets, and I saved my PM mobile presets as DNG. So now that you have all your presets saved into iCloud or Google Drive or whatever you're using, we can start importing them into our Lightroom mobile. So in order to do that, we just open Lightroom. So what I've done to keep everything organized, I created a folder called presets and inside that I created an album called Peter McKinnon presets. If you go inside, I've imported all those DNG files and the way you do that is simply clicking on these three dots on top and then afterwards you select add photo from files and you go where you saved your presets. For me, it's presets mobile, PM mobile presets. And here you have all those files that we previously saved. So you click on it and that will automatically load on your mobile device. But because I already have it, it said that is duplicated, so it will not import it. But how do you transform these into actual presets? Well, the way you do that is you simply click on the image and afterwards on the three dots on the top and you select create preset. Here you can either save it on the user preset or create a new preset group, but I'm just gonna save this into the user presets and I'm just gonna name this as tutorial. I'm gonna save that. And now that I have the preset saved, I can use it on all my photos. 
So let's go ahead, select a photo that we can apply the preset to. So if we go here, we can pick this photo. And now to apply the preset, I simply go to presets in the bar below. Go to my user presets and here I will have the one that I saved. And this is it. This is how simple it is to transfer your presets from your Lightroom Classic to your mobile device. I hope you found some value in this short Lightroom tutorial. If you have any questions, please make sure you leave them down below in the comments. And as always, you know the drill. Smash it, hit it, ring that bell, and I will see you in the next video. Take care.